Welcome back beauties. I'm so happy to see you around one more time. I just want to let you know that in today's video, I decided to play one more time with the bad boy right here. Ooh, makeup by Mario. I don't know guys, but I'm so happy to play with this eyeshadow. I'm so in love with the formula. I like the way that this eyeshadow blend. I love the history behind. I love that this eyeshadow are able to work on any type of skin tone. I'm in love with it. I just want to let you know that if you want to see how I create this tutorial, just stay tuned and keep on watching. Hey beauty, so today I decided to use my M100 CoverGirl Undercover Concealer. So I use that color for my base. Every time I do my eyeshadow, I like to use a light shade so that way the color can pop a little bit more. So I will be using again uh, Makeup by Mario eyeshadow palette because today I decided to do a more simple eye with a bow lip. So moving on, I will be starting with this color right here. And also I will be using his brush. So this is the EF2 from Makeup by Mario. Also, I will be using this color right here just to get a more deep crease. All right, beauties, so I will be also using this color right here with a flat brush all right beauty so today i will be using nyx professional makeup eyeliner so this is in black all right guys so look at the way this brush tip is i love the way it is i love how easy you can do your wing liner with this so it's amazing you need this in your makeup collection The lashes I'm wearing today are AMC underscore lashes on Instagram. These are in style moody. So if you really like this style, don't forget to go to her Instagram. She is from Delaware. If you're from Delaware and want to wear these lashes, she got it right away. So you can go DM her, let her know that you want these pair of lashes. And then she can either uh, try to meet you and then you can get the lashes or send it through mail. Alright guys, so moving on into today moisturizer, I will be using my all-time favorite Mura moisturizer. So this is a Energy Fix Night moisturizer that helps your skin to get more hydrate. So I like the way this feel on my skin. I don't know if you guys see any of my other video, but if you're new here, I just want to let you know that this is one of my favorite. All right, beauty, so I recommend 100% my 24-hour moisturizer from Kiehl. I like this moisturizer because it keeps my skin protect from the environment, so. All right, guys, so I just want to point it out that this primer is really good for normal skin, to dry skin, to combo. But if you have more oily skin, I recommend you to set with a setting powder because I've been using the primer for like two to three times and I haven't noticed that my skin get a little bit oily through the day so i love the way it worked on my skin but i don't like the way it gave me oil so i always use different primer and it's the first time that happened to me so i just want to let you know all right beauty so i will be using uv display foundation in color 520 i know it look a little bit lighter when i'm applying the foundation on my face but it oxidized all right beauty so i love this foundation i love the way it feel on my skin if you have more dry skin i recommend you to go hydrate your skin drink a lot of water moisturize get a face mask before you apply this foundation because it probably could be a little bit dry on you and it can probably show up dry patches if you're more dry skin so i recommend you hydrate your skin very good before you use this foundation but it's really good i highly recommend it i love the way this foundation cover my skin i love how it look on my skin like my makeup always look flawless when i use this foundation but also you can incorporate 
this um, liquid glow into your foundation so that way the foundation look a little bit more dewy so that way it doesn't look too dry but you can get the coverage from the foundation all right beauty so after i blend my foundation i will be using covergirl concealer in the color n500 also i will be mixing with m900 because i like to give myself more like that natural cover first and then i like to highlight with this concealer in particular, you have to work fast because it gets dry very easy, but I love the way it covered my skin. So I feel like it gave me a very good full coverage. All right, beauty, so I will be setting my face with the I Am Magic Juvia's Place setting powder. This is in color Kalahari. So I love more a yellow undertone because I love the way it looks on my skin. I feel it helped me a little bit more with my dark circles. So it helped me to prevent to get more dark circles. So go back again, blend really good. Make sure everything is well blend because you don't want the concealer get creased and also you don't want the powder sit on top of your fine line. So yes, if you have the money to do uh, Botox or if you do have money to do filler, go ahead and do your filler. But after in the meantime, Please make sure everything is well blend and apply so that way you don't get no fine lines and you don't get that much dry under your eyes. All right, beauty. So if you don't want your under eye look too dry, make sure you set the concealer right away. Make sure you blend really good the concealer, but also hydrate your under eye before you apply concealer because that way you can prevent more of the fine line. But if you can get filler or Botox, go ahead and do it, girl, because you don't have to deal with all. All right, guys. So I will be contour and bronze my skin with Tequila Town. All right guys, so taking this eyeshadow blending brush from Sephora, I will be doing my nose contour. And I like to connect my nose contour from my eyeshadow. I mean, you guys, look how gorgeous this eyeshadow works. I feel like you need this eyeshadow palette in your collection. Like if you don't have it, please go ahead and try, give it a try because this is my second tutorial using this eyeshadow palette and I feel like it's a must have. It's a really must have, it's so beautiful. I love the way it works in my skin. Like, you can see this is my second tutorial and it looks amazing. It looks so pretty. I love the way this eyeshadow blend, like, it's on point. This is Gisper of Guild. I feel like you need this in your makeup collection. If you don't have it, please go ahead and grab it because, I mean, you can see how glowy is my skin. I don't have to work too much to get the brightness, to get the pigment, to get the glow and all of that stuff. So that's why I always use this one. I don't play when it comes to my highlight. I just go to the one that I know it always gonna give me what I like and it works for me. All right guys, so I will be setting my face with the Morphe and Jeffree Star collaboration setting mist because I want my skin look a little bit more dewy but I don't want to be too dry. All right guys, so using KKW 2.5 lip liner because I will be doing a bright lip today. All right, beauty, so the liquid lipstick I will be using today is from CoverGirl. This is the 130, 1 o'clock. So let's see how this works on my lip. I love the bright red. All right. It feels nice. It doesn't get to dry fast. I have to get a little more from my... But you know, this bad boy right here did it again. Like, I feel like you need this palette in your collection. Like, I just wanna try it one more time just to see how many different look I can create with it. So yes, I approve it. I recommend it. Oh my God, this is gorgeous. It's amazing. You need this in your collection. I mean, look how beautiful my makeup turns out today. Like, it's gorgeous, especially with the bow lip. Honey, you need these in your collection. All right, beauties, I just want to say thank you so much for staying until the end of this tutorial. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and also click the bell right there so that way you can see more videos like this.